Now I'm gonna show you how you can set up a fly rig using a spinning reel. It's really pretty simple. It works, you know, tactics the same, just you're gonna cast it easier with a spinning reel here. The biggest key is this aqua bubble or a fly bubble, whichever you may know it as or however you find it. They're called lots of different things. But the biggest key with these is this inside a cylinder here. It pops out, see that? And you use, the, use it that way, you pull it out as far as it'll go. You can fill this bubble with water. By doing so, it gives you the weight necessary to cast a fly. The easiest way to set these up is with a swivel. Put the bubble on the line, pull up the line through the bubble, tie it to the swivel, and then tie your leader to this side of the swivel down to your fly. Pretty simple. Show you here how we do it real quick. Make sure to put it through the thick end. See this end of the bubble, it's a little thicker than this one. You wanna put it through this end so that way your swivel and stuff isn't catching inside. Slide your bubble on, grab your swivel. All right, tie whatever knot you like to tie. I like to tie a polymer knot, so take it through the eyelet, pull a good amount through, about eight, 10 inches, makes it easy. Back through the eyelet, leaving yourself a good inch, half, two inches here. Take the loop back over your main line and tag. Back through that loop and take your swivel through there. And grab your tag and your main line, pull it tight. Like so. All right, trim. Take our line with the fly here. I'm running four pound line, just period. That's what's spooled on the spinning reel, so I'm just gonna use that for my leader as well. Work, work just fine. Now here, you're gonna be able to tie a polymer not very easy, so. And tie whatever you want to tie. I'll probably just tie a uh, proof clinch knot. Just take it through the eyelet once, loop it back over, and then wrap it around the main line. No, oh, four, five times. I'm gonna go five. And take your tag in down through this loop that you made down by the eyelet. And then it's gonna make, it'll make another loop. So a regular clinch knot, you just pull it tight from there. With this improved clinch knot, you take that tag in back through that second loop that you made and pull it tight from there. Like that. Then trim. Always leave a little excess because it ain't gonna make no difference. And there you have it. It's pretty cool and it's way cheaper than a fly rod. Hello everyone, thanks for watching this video. Hope to help you move towards your fly fishing adventures. And if you're looking to move up to a real fly rod, go ahead and hit the link above. The link will take you to another video where I show you how I set my fly rods up. And while you're at it, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And until next time, get outside and do something.